we're going to do some bee beards today. Uh, we have a few volunteers that uh, want to, are stepping up to do this. Uh, so the first thing we do is we cage the queen. We found the queen in this colony. We've set the supers off and we've caged the queen. And we're going to make a necklace out of this queen so it will be suspended from the bearder's chin, like so. And uh, it's ideal if you have a good nectar flow happening here. Sometimes people will move the hive away so the field bees uh, aren't there. So you're just dealing with young bees, but we've got some brave volunteers today, so we're, we're not gonna bother with any of that. We're just gonna shake the bees right out of here. So we'll put, tie the queen on, we'll take frames out, we'll shake them onto a cloth, and then we'll pour them on to the bearder. So let's go. Now breathe, breathe deeply, <laughs> Ivan. It only stings, right? Only. All right. <laughs> only stings. So we got Ivan here, and we have Stephanie, both volunteering. There we go. And we got our, our bee queen necklaces on. We set up a little station here, so we're going to be shaking the bees onto this feed bag here, and then we'll pour the bees on. Ivan will provide a support. He's going to keep his arms tight to his body so the bees don't get underneath his armpits there. And then he's going to create a little shelf, like so, so that when we pour the bees, they have a platform to land on, and then the bees can run up and join on to his, join, hang from his chin. This is, we're basically simulating a bee swarm when they would hang on a tree branch. So there's a nice little tree branch we got here. So let's go with the bees. <laughs> Actually, I think the newspaper worked better. Well, we got a few bees there. Good job, Ivan. Okay. Steph, now what you should actually do, yeah, the ones that do go on a wee little walk. Up there. Mm -hmm. I'll follow you around. We'll try and keep it. I think that's a done beard. That's looking so very good. <laughs> looking good. Got my Ontario Farm Association <laughs> card here to work with here. <laughs> Since we are bee farmers after all. Good. Now let's go for a walk. Just the bee promenade. Okay. Maybe stop there. That's a good photo for them. So Ivan's just about ready to get these bees taken off, as you might be able to tell. What, we're, what he's going to do is he's going to give a sharp jolt so that the bees fall down in front of their, the entrance to their own colony and then they can run in. Uh, you do get some bees inside your shirt when you do this mm -hmm. maybe, uh, and a few extra bees around. So we have a bee blower here that we're gonna use to blow the rest of the bees off. I'll get that started and then, then Ivan will do the jolt. Jump up high in the air and then land with a jolt so the bees fall in front of you. And then you'll then right, right where you are right now. Good. Now step back and do it again. Do it again. Good. Okay, you ready? Here we go.
eventually take her out of there. There we go. And we'll lay her in by the, by the entrance there. So what you're going to do is come over and stand right here and shake with your head. It'll come this way here. Great. And I'll get the bee blower going, but what you'll do is you'll tip your head forward and jolt. Mm -hmm. And then you step back once and jolt again. You do that twice, then I'll blow the bees off. And then if you want, you can go around behind the hives there to take your shirt off. Uh, but the camera won't follow her, okay? We'll all look the other way. But it's up to you whether you need, want, need, want or need to do that. Mm -hmm. The queen's right at the entrance, so don't jump there. Mm -hmm. Okay, we'll get the blower going. those last few ones inside. She did great, didn't she? That was wonderful. <laughs>